There are a ton of free genealogy educational videos right here on YouTube. Today I'm highlighting some of the best professional genealogists and their channels that you can watch so that you can learn a little bit more about your family history. Now, we're also gonna talk about kind of why we do what we do, and believe it or not, toward the end, we're gonna talk about how we make money so we can bring you this free content. We're not talking about those big companies like Ancestry and Family Search. We're talking about the individual professional genealogists. There are a lot of them on YouTube. I invited them to submit a clip for your understanding and to give you a little bit of an idea what their channel is about because everybody has a little bit of a different twist on genealogy education. So we're gonna get into all of that coming up next. Okay, so just so you'll know, throughout this video, there's gonna be that at symbol with the channel name on there. So if you wanna find your favorite best genealogist, you can do that with the at symbol. And so just kind of be mindful of that as we go through. Make sure you like and subscribe to these guys because we're all busting our butts every week to put out videos for you. Well, let's get started. Okay, keep in mind that this is in no particular order. There's like, there's no ranking here. I'm just giving you a handful of people that have uh, great genealogy skills. And first up is Amy Johnson Crow. Hi, I'm Amy Johnson Crow. And my YouTube channel is Genealogy with Amy Johnson Crow. My goal is to help you make discoveries in your family history without the overwhelm and actually enjoy the process. Yes, it is possible to do good genealogy research and have fun at the same time. In my years as a professional genealogist, a degreed librarian, and someone who used to work at Ancestry.com, I've noticed so many people feel really frustrated by genealogy research. I felt that way myself. On my channel, I break things down so you don't feel the overwhelm. Whether it's sharing tips and tricks about your favorite genealogy website, sharing some cool resources that maybe you've never heard of before, or helping you feel confident that that record that you found really is your ancestor and not just someone with the same name, I wanna help you make those connections to your family's past and uncover your family's stories. There might even be a few bad jokes along the way. So if that sounds like your cup of tea or coffee or whatever your favorite beverage is, Check out Genealogy with Amy Johnson Crow and make some great discoveries in your family tree. Thanks, Amy. I appreciate it. Hey, if you happen to have a smartphone, you can actually watch YouTube on your television if you have a smart TV that is hooked to the same Wi-Fi as your smartphone. All you have to do is have the YouTube app open on your smartphone and then while you're watching on your smart TV on the same Wi-Fi, a lot of times you can connect. I'm not gonna get into all the details of how you can do that. Guess what? You can go on YouTube and figure that out. There is a great, uh, there's a lot of videos on how to connect your smart TV uh, to your cell phone. In fact, a lot of times you could probably even search the actual model number of your television to see if it's capable of doing that. Consider doing that and uh, you can actually connect with your favorite YouTubers. And next up is Lisa Lesson. Hey guys, it's Lisa Lesson with Are You My Cousin YouTube channel and blog. Exploring genealogy isn't just about adding names to your family tree. It's about breathing life into those names, discovering who they were, understanding their triumphs, their challenges, and life experiences. Each document and faded photograph that we find is really just chock full of history waiting for us to discover it and tell the story behind it. And that's why each Tuesday I post genealogy and family history focused videos to help you find your ancestors, grow that family tree, but not be overwhelmed in the process. YouTube offers an interactive platform where I can visually demonstrate the process of tracing your lineage. It also allows me to talk through with you various genealogy strategies to help find those particularly hard to find ancestors. And you know, we all have them. Plus, the YouTube channel complements my blog perfectly. While my blog posts provide written detail on strategies and resources, the YouTube channel allows me to demonstrate a more hands-on approach. It's an opportunity for you to look over my shoulder, so to speak, as I research. Beyond that, YouTube offers to those researching their genealogy 
an opportunity to learn from experts in the field, to tap into their wisdom and their guidance. Really, it's like having a genealogy conference in your living room. So whether you're just starting out on your genealogy journey or you are a seasoned researcher and have been at it for years, I'm here to guide, inspire, and celebrate with you every step along the way as you seek out your ancestors. See you over on the Are You My Cousin YouTube channel. Thanks, Lisa. Okay, so here's another thing I would recommend that you do. In the description box, there is a list of all of the channels that we're talking about. And, you know, if you want to help us out, it doesn't cost you anything, but go in there and subscribe to all these channels. Uh, and subscribe to mine, too, while you're here, you know. But, uh, yeah, so if you subscribe, like, that kind of stuff, it really helps the channel out a lot, and we appreciate it. So, next on my list is Amy Cross. Hi, I'm Amy Cross and I love doing genealogy and that's why I started a YouTube channel. My YouTube channel is at Ancestry Amy and I work really hard to provide you with genealogy hints that will help you take your genealogy to the next level. I want you to be able to find the records that you're not able to find and learn from somebody that's been a professional for a while. I've been a professional genealogist for 10 years but I've been doing genealogy for 40, yes, really 40. And so I just love finding my family and I think finding your family is a very meaningful and emotional and just substantial thing that can happen in your life. And so my son encouraged me to start the YouTube channel and I did it. So I hope that the videos help you. I tend to do more instructional videos where I will go through and take you through step by step how to do something. Not always, but a lot of times that's what I do and I love it. So watch my channel. Hey, thanks Amy for submitting. I, you know, these guys are really kind of, I, I put them out to put together these little snippets of videos. And so I do appreciate it. And you know, one thing that you can consider is to ring that bell notification too. that. And if you have the notification set correctly on your YouTube settings, then you should be able to get notified when each of these creators are putting up new information so you can keep track of them. You know, another thing is to consider joining their newsletters. A lot of, a lot of the YouTubers have newsletters so that you get notification right in your inbox, like I do. You know, that link is in the description as well. All right, next up is uh, Devin Noel Lee. So let's check that one out. Ever want to turn your family history into captivating tales across generations? Howdy. I'm Devin Noel Lee, and I'm on a mission to transform dusty family records into captivating stories. On the Write Your Family History YouTube channel, I guide genealogists in quickly converting research into engaging family histories. After losing my grandmother and mother in 2012, I was determined to honor the women who inspired me to become a genealogist. But I faced a challenge. How do you transform dry facts into compelling narratives without a creative writing background? I recalled my journalism training and scrapbook techniques that I had learned, and in one year, I penned stories for 120 ancestors. I've since published biographies, ancestral narratives, and insightful sketches, gaining immense knowledge that I'm eager to share with you. The exciting part, I didn't choose just any platform to share my stories and my tips and tricks. I chose YouTube for a specific reason. With my flagship channel, Family History Fanatics, I've seen YouTube explode in the past seven years with educational content specifically for genealogists of all levels. It's more than a platform. It's a vibrant community of learners and creators. Whether it's understanding DNA results, research strategies, or family tree building, YouTube is a treasure trove of knowledge, an amazing video library of learning. I'm counting on your support for my new channel, Write Your Family History, and continued support of my flagship channel, Family History Fanatics. Your stories matters, and I will help you tell them. Join me on this thrilling journey by subscribing using the provided links, and let's tap into the power of storytelling and genealogy research to create legacies that encourage connection and belonging. Awesome. Thank you so much for submitting that clip. Now, Hey, if you didn't know, there is also a live tab. A lot of these creators do live. Occasionally I'll do a live, but you know, they uh, go on live and boy, that's a lot of fun because then there's a lot of engagement in the chat window and whatnot. 
And so you can get really involved and get questions answered and that kind of stuff when YouTubers do live sessions. So make sure even on the replay, if you're checking out the live tab on the channel as well. All right. Next up is Jarrett Ross. Let's hear what his channel is all about. Hello everybody, I am Jarrett Ross from the YouTube channels Genie Vlogger and Professional Genealogist Reacts. On my main channel, Genie Vlogger, I do different genealogy series, one focused on tracing the family trees of other YouTubers, such as Mr. Beat, Cynical Historian, Tasting History with Max Miller, and many more. I also do videos diving into different topics around genealogy, such as genie.com, find a grave, different DNA tools, and just all sorts of stories related to the genealogy field. And for my Professional Genealogist Reacts channel, I do reactions to videos about people getting their DNA tests done, or videos related to genealogy in different ways. I first got on YouTube because I loved YouTube, and I also wanted to create a career out of genealogy. And so I used it as a way to put my work out there, and to build an audience as well as find clients. One of the reasons why I decided to make a genealogy YouTube channel was because I felt that after watching a lot of what was available at the time, which this was back in like 2016, 2017, that it was not really up to par with a lot of the other stuff that I saw on YouTube, that it was really geared more towards the typical education stuff and the videos weren't quite encapsulating in my opinion. So I felt if I could make videos that were geared more towards the YouTube audience that I knew that weren't really watching genealogy, maybe I could bring more people in that would be interested. Since then, the YouTube genealogy space has grown immensely with a ton of new channels. A bunch of the channels that were on previously have built their audiences even more and done new series. And there's just a lot of things available for genealogy now on YouTube. Thanks, Jared. I appreciate it. Hey, did you know that you can go into your history and go back and see some of the videos again that you've already seen? Yeah, because sometimes you're watching on your television, right? And you go, oh, I want to go back to my computer and really follow those steps each time. You can do that by going back into the history on your YouTube feed, and then you can see, oh yeah, th there's the video I wanna look at, and so you can do that. All right, so next up is Sherry Passy. Before we go to Sherry, I wanna just say one more thing. Your comments are really what drives us. Uh, a lot of what we do, we do, um, it's not an ego stroke or anything, it's just, you know, there's so much ugliness in the world, and the comments that you guys put out really, keep us going. I've had several of my friends here that are professional genealogists and they're kind of like, you know, we don't make a lot of money off those ads. So why do we do what we do? Because of the kind words that you guys say. And every time you go, wow, that really helped me out. It means a lot to us. So thank you for the very kind words. All right. So let's talk to Sherry and see what she has to say. Hi, everybody. I'm Sherry Hudson Passy, host of Gen Friends, a genealogy chat show on YouTube. Each week, I gather with a group of genealogy friends, professional genealogists from all walks of life to talk about everything related to research, methodology, DNA, genealogy TV shows, which we love to cover, and so much more. We often invite special guests who are experts on a genealogy topic and ethnic group or research location. They may have a product that we think you should know about, like a book or a new computer or online program. We talk about museums or other libraries that may be helpful for you, conferences and other educational opportunities. With the unique and varying experiences of each of our weekly panel members, you're sure to learn, be inspired, and have fun. We love to learn from our viewers too. So make sure to leave a comment and join in the conversation. YouTube is a great place to learn about genealogy and become part of a community striving to find and connect with family. So we invite you to join us by subscribing and become one of our gen friends. We sure hope to see you there. Thank you, Sherry. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for submitting the clips. 
So one of the biggest questions I get a lot is how we make money. So there's on platform, which means on YouTube, and then there's off platform. So uh, what I'm going to explain now is on platform. So on the YouTube channel, there is ad revenue. Honestly, it's not a lot. Every time you watch an ad, we get a little tiny snippet of it, but if you skip that ad, we get nothing. So if you can watch at least 30 seconds, we do appreciate it because we get a little something out of it. Now that's maybe a penny or two. I don't know. It, it just kind of depends. But you know the old saying, watch your pennies and your dollars will follow. Well, all of those little 30 seconds add up to a little something uh, as part of how we make money on the YouTube platform if the channel is monetized. I think most of these creators, their channel is monetized. So, you know, if you want to help out and it doesn't really cost you anything but 30 seconds, watch at least 30 seconds of an ad and that really does help us out a lot. Another thing is merchandise. So a lot of people have either shops or they have linked a an off-platform t-shirt shops. There's a lot of little things that merchandise you can actually get something of value out of and it does help the creator as well. There are things like super thanks. So if you're watching a video and you really got something out of it and you felt it was worth a couple bucks, uh, hit that super thanks button and help the creator out because the super thanks and when you're doing live programs like super chats and super stickers are also available during live presentations, that all of that little stuff helps add up a lot. There are channel memberships. A lot of us have channel memberships and that really kind of is a game changer for creators. That does help a lot. And you know, for a few dollars a month, you can you know get some inside perks or get some handouts or whatever the, the creator is offering for uh, perks for their channel memberships. Then there are things like off platform. And off-platform are things like Patreon. A lot of us have a Patreon account. So Patreon, I think there's another one called Buy Me a Cup of Coffee, which is kind of similar. Um, but with those kind of platforms, the creator keeps a lot more of the percentage. And it is actually a better way in some ways for you, the viewer, to communicate with the creator and then also we can email you handouts or whatever the perks are that are being offered on the Patreon account. And so that is a, a really great platform for creators like myself. Then there are other off-platform opportunities as well, like I sell the handouts. If somebody doesn't want to be a member of anything on my channel, you could go to my website at genealogytv.org and buy the handouts individually as you need them. In my case, my members, if they're at the right level, they get the handouts as part of, part of the deal. Now, a lot of us have services. So there's coaching. Some of, some of these creators have coaching. Some of them have group coaching. Some of them have classes. I have an academy where I have classes once a month. There's just a lot of services that we offer that the YouTube channel helps us promote. So in one way from a business standpoint, the YouTube channel is a promotional tool for us, but really our goal is to help you with your research, right? That truly is our driving factor. The comments that you leave when you say, wow, that really helped me out a lot. It motivates us to keep making more videos. So I encourage you to subscribe and like and comment and all of that helps all of us, you know, as creators to keep going and keep making content that you can absorb for free. And uh, so with that, I hope that was helpful. There are plenty of videos uh, for you to watch on the screen and links to all of the other channels in the description box below. All right, we'll catch you in the next one. See you later, bye.